everyone, Miss Connie here, and today I am in our classroom. It's been a long time since we've been in the classroom, but that's okay. It's still here, and we miss you. And today, uh, I would just like to say hi, and I want to start with uh, remembering uh, the open and close them because I'd like to start in a prayer. So if you'd like to have a seat and sit down and start. So here we go. So open, shut them, open, shut them, give a little clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them, put them in our lap. Lord, we would just like to thank you for everything you've done. Thank you for your healings and your prayers you answer. And Lord, just thank you for videos to be able to communicate and to see one another. Thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. So today's lesson is about uh, Jesus healing a leper. And we know that today this world is a little different and we have a lot of sickness in today's world too. So we also pray for people to be healed when they're sick. So on today's lesson, uh, we talk about uh, Jesus talking to a leper and you can uh, go into your Bible and ask uh, your parents to read you Matthew chapter 8, 1 through 4 to hear the uh, Jesus and the leper or uh, Mark uh, chapter uh, 1 verses 40 through 45 or Luke chapter 5 verse 12 through 15. Now, the, the story goes that uh, Jesus is walking and he hears a leopard calling to him and begging him to heal him. And Jesus reaches to him and touches him and heals him. And all he feels so much better. And when you feel better, you're so happy and excited. So he thanked Jesus. And Jesus says, go and tell the priest um, that I've healed you. But don't tell anybody else. Well, he goes and he tells. And because he's so happy. And that's what we do when we're happy. We go and tell everybody. So that's what we go and do. And today I went and handed out uh, backpacks. And I saw a young girl, Hello. probably about your ages, who got a backpack and she was so happy. So today I'm asking uh, for prayers for our people who uh, are going away. As I've seen uh, lots of people at church who are, are going on vacation or uh, just moving. And so I'm asking uh, for you to just pray for their safe travels um, to their vacation or wherever they're moving to their new places. So uh, pray for them and pray for sick people because uh, that's happened a lot now. So don't forget to remember to wash your hands and be safe. Ask your parents if they need help and uh, Miss Connie misses you. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs>